And we are underway with singles action here on Anarchy. Todd Sexton taking on P Dog, Mike Posey. Nina Monet at ringside. How does one get their hair that green? I'm not so sure. Lampmare take over by Sexton. Mix him up. Goes to work on the arm. Takes Posey down to a knee. I guess Mike Posey took exception to the statement that Todd made about him some time ago that the only person that's wider than Todd Sexton in the back is Mike Posey, and he evidently didn't like that too well. So is that a spray tan or something? I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that's what it is. I think he was talking about, you know, attitude, oh. posing, things of that nature. Gotcha. But so right, Todd Sexton is neon white. He is very neon white, but p Dogs is going to have to go it alone this week without CB Suave or Raphael King or Devin Nicole. All of them are absent, so right now, I mean, he's got Nina Monet, but... Yeah, where's the rest of the old get-along gang here? I'm, I'm not so sure. At a get-along convention. <laughs> Todd Sexton offering his arm up again. Nina wants him to take it. What's he giving him? His arm. Can you see? Oh, okay. I thought he actually had him a present. I don't know what it is. Don't look at me for answers. I'm, I'm just an announcer. Sort of. I'm not an announcer, but I play one on television. Same here. Just this week and last week. Just this week, yes. Just a couple of weeks. It was a... Uh, it was only a couple time gig. Did you ever take that forklift away from that door you had him blocked behind? No, I never got a chance to. Do you miss John Johnson at all? Did you put air holes in that box? I think so. Food? A little bit. Okay. I think you miss John Johnson a little bit, don't you? Not so much. Not so much, man. Okay. Well, about as much as he probably misses me this week. Well, it looks like uh, Mike Posey took up the invitation of Todd Sexton to grab the arm. I think P-Dog's a little upset that he had to break the hold. Uh, no, it's, now the uh, the aggravation is starting to set in on Mike Posey. This is that side headlock on Todd Sexton. Look here, Hacksaw Jim Duggan. I could have swore I did. I didn't realize we were in Glens Falls. What the... He just went armadillo on us. He's being the tip of a Q-tip. He's taking him out for a roll. That's the worst yoga I've ever seen in my life. What in the absolute world is this? He's pinning himself. Cover him. What in the wide, wide world sports of this? He shoots a ping pong ball out. I'm out of here. <laughs> if he does that, I'll buy his dinner. I'm glad the camera's on this side because from the other side, you can see his tonsils from behind. The other side, we'd have to put a rating on the television show. We have restored order, ladies and gentlemen. What's going on, Brett? I, I have no idea. <laughs> how do we how do we even offer any type of insight on what we just saw? I, I, I've been a part of the Anarchy roster for almost four years, and I think that may be one, the second time I've been rendered speechless. That was an interpretive dance. The, the, the first time was when a fan offered me his dentures when I told him that my teeth weren't working. That's awful. Yeah. If you go to my Facebook page, that's my profile picture. It was right after he told me that. Oh, okay. That's what you were so giddy about. Old school. Oh! What a little new school twist. I could have almost broken the arm of Mike Posey. You'd never see Hulk Hogan do that. Absolutely. No, you would not. Well, crisscross, and I don't know about you, but that always made me jump. Oh, I got. I see what you did there. Uh, 
I don't think Nina Monet enjoyed hugging up to Todd Sexton. About as much as Todd Sexton enjoyed hugging up with Nina Monet. What in the world? We're going to crisscross the opposite way. What's what? Oh, he got me too. I looked up. <laughs> I thought he. I thought one of the lives was maybe coming apart. That wouldn't shock me. Actually, I think they did replace a few of the lights ahead of the tapings this week. <laughs> Ouch. That stings. You know, going to work on the head of Todd Sexton. Hina Monado went and busted his finger. I'm trying to call a match, and you're over here having a conniption. I'm sorry. You will have those moments here every now and then, ladies and you gentlemen. You want to check your depends? I think you sold them. I may have. <clears throat> that was funny. Oh. Fan, moments like that are why we encourage you to come out here and check us out live. Second and fourth Saturdays of every month, and also the fifth Saturdays, those rare months that we do have the five Saturdays a month for our exciting Anarchy Television tapings and our super events because a lot of things that happen you do not get to see on television. That is true. Well, if you want to see Anarchy in its complete unedited form, you need to be here at the Church of Southern Wrestling, Level Grove Road, Cornelia, Georgia, those second and fourth Saturdays. That could be all right there, Brett. Oh! He got it two. Two and 15 sixteenths. <laughs> Forearm shots by P Dog, countered by Sexton. Back and forth. Uppercut by Sexton. Punch by Posey. A rare exchange. Grope caught. Sweeps oh. the leg. <coughs> Cover eight. Kick out of two. Now we've got an argument out on the floor over the count. However, Nita Monet and the fans, nine, none are licensed referees. Uh, Todd Sexton goes up to the top rope. Nita Monet has the foot of Sexton. That might have been all it took. He's going to go up top. Your favorite leg drop. Didn't go for it. Outsmart it. No, no, no. Oh. Into the cross face. No. That is not a cross face. Whatever it is, it looks like it hurts. That was a variation on the rings of Saturn. Wait a minute. What was... Who throws a shoe? Did she seriously just throw a shoe? Seriously, who throws a shoe? Should that be a... Oh, a low blow. Causing the distraction. Oh, come on. Your winner of the match, P-Dog, Mike Posey. P-Dog. Well... You know, there are such things as low blows, and then there's Mike P-Dog Posey. Low. That's a whole different category. Fans, we'll be back with our P-Dog. going out like that. I tell you what, next week, 10 years, baby. Why don't you bring your boys and uh, I'll call a couple of my friends. Maybe uh, Sal Renaro or or the king of the sexy party, Seth Delay. By the way, don't worry about me. My wife will check on me later. All right. We know, the, we know that I got balls, so let's see if you got any and see if you accept. Hey, dog. I've been doing this crap for a long time, all right, dog? 
I knew you were going to do something like that because you've done it about a million times in this building, all right? And you also knew that my big man, Raphael King, he ain't going to be here next week, dog. You knew that. But that's all right. That's all right. I got something else for you. I got somebody me and you both know real good. He's your best friend. No. He's your best friend. He was your best man. You were his best man. He's approved Jimmy Rave. Yeah, dog. That's my boy. Right there. <laughs> How about that, dog, huh? What's up? Next week. Play my music. P-Dog In the house, 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 house. P-Dog